Peppa! Uh, what's up, Peppa freaks? <laughs> Uh, Pe Pe Peppa fans, all all people who live within the Peppa verse, and uh, want want to explore its many facets and items. Uh, this is this is Plushy in the Plushy Channel with my friend Max here. Hi, Max here. Uh, it's Maxwell, but it's short. It's Max with an X. <laughs> anyway, today we're reviewing these uh, and unboxing these. Peppa Finders Keepers Milk Chocolate Candy Surprises. Uh, there's going to be one of 10 Peppa figures inside there, and we're going to figure out which one. Yeah, let's get a close-up of these boxes. We're going we're gonna to film that after we do this. Yeah, yeah. And then put it right. in and post. Sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're going to understand the film industry. Here is a close-up of the box. We've got the Finders Keepers Peppa Pig Milk Chocolate Candy and Surprise. Uh... It says actual size not shown. Huh, sounds like a lot of boys on 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 Tinder. Am I right with their pics of oh wow. Uh We we bought these on a on a run for age appropriate drinks. We we bought the store out. Apparently there was Mac, Max says that there was only one left. That yeah, it was already busted open, and it seems like somebody had stolen the toy from inside of it, which I would not expect from a Peppa fan. But you know they're out there. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna name any names, but there's some Pedro ponies out there. <laughs> some real Pedro ponies. <laughs> we're gonna do a point system for these. Uh, we're gonna have uh, different characters worth different amounts of points based Let's, on their rarity and desirability. Based on vaguely rarity and desirability. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that. <laughs> I think more so that, uh, I don't know how this is going to work because I we've tiered it so that the Peppas and the Georges are worth one point. Uh, Mommy, Daddy Pig, and the Astronaut Peppa, which is a separate, more exclusive Peppa, is going to be two points. And then Danny Dog and Emily Elephant are going to be three points. But here's my question, is that since there are only like one character for each of these, does that make them more or less abundant? Because would they just print a ton more of the one with the same mold? I feel like they would do the same run of each different figure. Yeah. Personally, that would be my bet. Yeah, well, well, we'll crack into these puppies and see. That's a lot of questions to answer. Yeah. All right, um, do you wanna... Let's cut the tape right, real good. quick so we can... Let me go grab that. All right, so, uh, do you want to play rock, paper, scissors for who goes first? Yeah, sounds good. Just one out of one. No, best of three is the only way to do rock, paper, scissors. Okay, I suppose you're right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Damn it. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Damn it, you know I always pick scissors. Yes, I always <laughs> pick rock, dude. Uh, avalanche tactic. <laughs> It always works, never fails. Fun fact. Remember if, that, YouTube. If you always pick the same one, don't tell your friends which one that is. Fuck. Also. <laughs> I done played myself. I played okay. myself as well. <laughs> yeah, well, All right, so, it so, um, I'm going to be opening this first one here. Peppa Pig, Finders Keepers. We're going to see what we got. Um, comes in a, uh, it actually turns out the chocolate egg is uh, completely melted. It's very hot in our apartment. We don't have central air conditioning. Um, so we're going to put that aside for later. <laughs> <laughs> um, another thing is we live here in America, so the toy is not inside the chocolate egg. Thank God in this uh, particular instance, because then it would be all covered in chocolate. But, um, yeah, like Kinder Eggs, we, we can't have that. Um, F, this is a mommy pig. Oh, yes, mommy pig. Two points there. Uh, it's kind of wobbly. She's kind of thick for her spindly legs. <laughs> So this oh, no. also this also tells me something about my question yeah, earlier. Really One of the things about this chef mommy pig too that I noticed and the question I had earlier about the assembly of them is actually pretty funny because it turns out that these are assembly pieces. And I feel like since the body parts have a lot of the same quality and shapes, I feel like only the heads are recast. I don't think the entire character is recast. I think the mommy and daddy pig are different. Wait, what? All right, you can tell that the, the boys are like spherical and the girls are shaped like a dress. And also the mommy and daddy figures seem to be bigger than the other ones. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. hold up, let's peek. No, he's straight up right. We got, we got the gumdrop looking women 
and those orb ass looking men. That's how you can tell. Oh, actually, Emily Elephant is an orb too. Emily, she's. Oh, yeah, look at that. She's defying gender norms. Wow, good job, Emily. Good job, Emily Elephant. 2019, Emily. 29. Oh, I lost mommy's legs. Oh, no. Oh, I stepped on a crack, I think. <laughs> Let's also inspect this packaging. We've got this little pill like capsule. Looks like the back of that guy's jacket on Akira. I always wondered how that the pigs were born. And then we've got all of the characters again, just like the back, except these ones look more saturated in color, or they look like brighter. These ones look really dark for some reason. Like they're standing in front of a light in like a dark alley, and they're about to come stab you. <laughs> it's not very good photography, there. Yeah, that yeah was compared just to the actual figure, not good. I think the actual figure is closer to the. Uh, yeah, yeah. Insert. <laughs> Do something and put this out in. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Extinguish the oxygen source, that's how you stop a fire. Oh my god, Smokey the Bear over here. Uh, we're in a race against time here because it's really, really hot. <laughs> I, I had to turn the fan off because I didn't want it to noise pollute the video. But gosh darn it, if it isn't hot as heck, this egg is just ruined. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a little taste though. Give it a little, give it a little scholar's taste. Mm. That? Good shit. All right. Well, let's see what capsule we have attained. Mm. Ugh. Wait, no freaking way. I also got Chef Hat Mommy oh, Pig. Oh, man, we got... No! <laughs> no! Mommy Pig! <laughs> Alright, okay, so we got the third um, Peppa Pig unboxing. So far we've got two Mommy Pigs. We're hoping for a little something different this time. Uh, we're hoping for some variety up in here. Um, this egg seems to be more intact. It's more egg-shaped right now. I'm actually going to try a little bit as well. Let's see. I'm noticing uh, a nice four note of chocolate with a strong finishing taste of um, melted chocolate. So we're gonna put this over here. It was all right, I would say. I'm probably not gonna finish it, to be real. Um, just from peeking, I don't think this is the same one. Oh, fuck, I see a chef's hat in there. <laughs> all right, let's see. Let's hope for a daddy pig. All right. Well, fuck me, dude. <laughs> <laughs> this is bullshit. Alright, as you can see from these pieces, it's just another uh, Chef Mommy Pig. So um, I guess I'm gonna put her together. Alright, the last and final chance to see what we've gotten. Uh, don't tell me. Boys, I don't even need to open this. I'm gonna show you what's what's up. Get out of the light so we can see it. See what that is? You recognize that? <laughs> <laughs> Mommy Pig is about to tell a scary story like that. <laughs> we got th th Oh my god. In the end, four Mommy Pig chefs. That is two points each, leaving us at a tie. So... We have to have a scat battle. <laughs> um, you know, a lot of these YouTubers are doing like ironic toy opening videos, but as a as a genuine Peppa fan, with Peppa genuine enthusiasts, I would say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We like Peppa. We like Peppa in this house. So this is kind of disappointing. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, yeah, do I was I... hoping for at least some variety. You can tell I'm a Peppa enthusiast by the various fan arts that we have on our wall. They are great and indicative of how much we care about Peppa. Even the little things in our day-to-day -day life involve Peppa the Peach. Do I love and appreciate mom, Mommy Pig? Yes, of course I do. Do I, do I like it when she cooks? I'm, I'm sure, I'm sure I would. But would I have loved to get an astronaut Peppa? You're damn straight. That would have been out of this world.
A huge thank you to my Patreon subscribers. Y'all keep me dunking on the Peppa haters every day and every night. And you also keep me fed. So I love you. Thank you.